We are a tiny part of a universe that is made of an infinite amount of space, matter, and time. There is more space than matter. All matter is made of particles of light. Light particles are the base unit of all matter from the tiniest particles to the largest galaxies. In this sense, light particles are the most basic atoms. The basic order of matter from smaller to larger is light particles, electrons and positrons, muons, protons and antiprotons, atoms, molecules, living objects, planets, stars, globular clusters, galaxies, and then galactic clusters. The universe has no start or end. The same light particles that have always been continue to move in the space that has always been. Matter and motion can never be created or destroyed. Matter can never be converted into motion, and motion can never be converted into matter. Light particles become trapped with each other and so form structures such as protons, atoms, molecules, planets, stars, galaxies, and clusters of galaxies. This accumulation of light particles into atoms may be the result of particle collision, gravitation, or a combination of both. All of the billions of galaxies we can see are only a tiny part of the universe. We will never see most of the universe because no light particles from there can ever reach us. Most galaxies are too far away for even one particle of light they emit to be going in the exact direction of our tiny location, and all of the light particles they emit are captured by atoms in between there and here. There is a pattern in the universe. Light particles move from highly dense volumes of space to volumes of less density. In low density volumes, light particles slowly accumulate to form atoms of hydrogen and helium, which exist as gas clouds like the Magellanic Clouds or Orion Nebula. These gas clouds, called nebulae, continue to accumulate trapped light particles. At points of high density, planets and stars form, and the cloud is eventually dense enough to become a galaxy of stars. The stars emit light particles back out to the rest of the universe, where the light again becomes trapped and forms new clouds. Around each star are many planets and pieces of matter. On many of the planets rotating around stars, living objects evolve that can copy themselves by converting matter around them into more of them. Living objects need matter to replace matter lost from the constant emitting of light particles, decay. Like bacteria, these living objects grow in number, with the most successful organisms occupying and moving around many stars. These advanced organisms then move the group of stars they control as a globular cluster away from the plane of the spiral galaxy. As time continues, all of the stars of a galaxy are occupied by living objects who have organized their stars into globular clusters. These globular clusters together form an elliptical galaxy, and then finally a globular galaxy. The globular galaxy may then exist for a long time, living off the matter in stars in addition to matter from external sources. So free light particles are trapped into volumes of space that grow in density, first forming atoms, then gas clouds, then stars, a spiral galaxy, an elliptical galaxy, and finally Finally, a globular galaxy. Globular galaxies at our scale may be light particles at a much larger scale, just as light particles at our scale may be globular galaxies at a much smaller scale. This system may go on infinitely in both a larger and smaller scale. An expanding universe seems unlikely to me. The supposed redshifted calcium absorption lines may be a mistaken observation. For one reason, because spectrum size changes the position of spectral lines, as clearly shown in the 1936 Hummison photo, and because the distance of a light source changes the position but not the frequency of spectral lines. The Milky Way Nebula starts to form. Galaxies may form from accumulation of light particles or from the collision of two or more galaxies. The first star in the Milky Way galaxy forms. Living objects in the Milky Way galaxy reach another star using a ship, the first globular cluster of 100,000 stars in the Milky Way galaxy. The star Earth orbits forms. Stars may form from the accumulation of matter or from the collisions of two or more large bodies. As less collisions occur over time, most smaller objects are absorbed by the larger star and planets. Stars and planets may have centers of densely packed unmoving light particles. Atoms may form in the less dense space near the surface of planets and stars where there are less collisions. Planets form around our star from many collisions. Like the star, they are red hot with liquid rock and metals on the surface. Lighter atoms move to the surface of the planets. Larger planets are surrounded by gas. As the number of collisions decreases and smaller objects are absorbed by the star and planets, the average temperature of the star system is lowered. As the temperature of the planets and moons decreases, water and other molecules condense at the surface. The moon of Earth is captured. Start of the Precambrian, the Hadean Eon. The oldest meteorite yet found on Earth, 4.5 billion years old. The oldest moon rock, 
Planet Earth cools. Molten liquid rock turns into a solid crust. Water condenses and falls to the surface, filling the lowest parts of the land to make the first Earth oceans, lakes, and rivers. The oldest terrestrial zircon, evidence that the crust and liquid water are on the surface of Earth. A terrestrial zircon is not from a meteorite. Larger molecules form on Earth, like amino acids, phosphates, and sugars, the components of living objects. These molecules are made in the oceans, fresh water, and atmosphere of Earth and other planets by lightning, from light particles with high frequency from the sun and around ocean floor volcanoes. The initial building blocks of living objects are easily formed, but assembling them into longer chain molecules or polymers is more difficult. Amino acids link up to form polymers called proteins, simple fatty acids plus alcohols link up to form lipids, oils and fats, simple sugars like glucose and sucrose link together to form complex carbohydrates and starches, and finally the nucleotide bases plus phosphates and sugars link up to form nucleic acids, the genetic code of organisms known as RNA and DNA. Possibly all all proteins, carbohydrates, and lipids are strictly the products of living objects. Nucleic acids form on Earth. Ribonucleic acid, RNA, may be the first nucleic acid to form. One of these RNA molecules may be the ancestor of all of life on Earth. The first proteins on Earth. Transfer RNA molecules evolve, tRNA, and link amino acids into proteins using other RNA molecules, messenger or mRNA, as a template. For the first time, a nucleic acid functions both as a template for building other nucleic acid molecules and also as a template for building proteins with the help of tRNA molecules. This protein assembly system is the main system responsible for all the proteins on Earth. Part of each tRNA molecule bonds with a specific amino acid and another part of the tRNA molecule bonds with an opposite matching three nucleotide sequence on an mRNA molecule. A protein can copy RNA. This protein is called an RNA polymerase. Eventually, an mRNA that codes for the necessary tRNA and RNA polymerase may be copied many times. The ribosome evolves. The first ribosomal RNA, rRNA. The ribosome may function as a protocell, providing a platform for more efficient protein production. A single RNA may contain all the instructions needed to make more ribosomes. All cells contain ribosomes. Ribosomes are the cellular organelles that carry out protein synthesis through a process called translation. These molecular machines are responsible for accurately translating the linear genetic code on the messenger RNA, mRNA, into a linear sequence of amino acids to produce a protein. The first deoxyribonucleic acid, DNA molecule. A protein evolves that allows the assembly of DNA from RNA, a ribonucleotide reductase. This protein changes ribonucleotides into deoxyribonucleotides, which allows the first DNA molecule on Earth to be assembled. A protein can copy DNA molecules, a DNA polymerase. Transcription, a protein assembles RNA from DNA. The first cell on Earth, a bacterium. DNA is surrounded by a membrane of proteins made by ribosomes. The first cytoplasm. This cell may form in either fresh or salt water, near the sunlit water surface, or near underwater volcanoes on the ocean floor. The DNA of this cell is a template containing the code for a copying molecule, DNA polymerase, and the necessary mRNA, tRNA, and rRNA molecules needed to build the cytoplasm. For the first time, ribosomes and DNA build cell structure. DNA protected by cytoplasm is more likely to survive and be copied. This is the start of binary cell division. A protein duplicates DNA within the cell and then the cell divides into two parts. This is also the start of passive transport. Molecules enter and exit the cytoplasm only because of a difference in concentration and represent the beginnings of the first digestive system. This cell structure forms the basis of all future cells of every living object on Earth. Cells make the first lipids on Earth, fats, oils, waxes. A phospholipid bilayer evolves around the cell, providing added protection from the external environment. All extant cells have this phospholipid bilayer. Operins evolve. Operins are sequences of DNA that allow a bacterium to produce certain proteins only when necessary. Bacteria before now can only build a constant stream of all proteins encoded in their DNA. Facilitated diffusion. Proteins in the cell membrane allow only certain molecules to enter the cell. Cellular respiration. Glycolysis evolves in the cytoplasm. Cells can make ATP, adenosine triphosphate, by converting glucose into pyruvate. 
This is the beginning of cellular respiration, how cells convert food into ATP and waste products. ATP is the molecule that drives most cellular work. Fermentation evolves in the cell cytoplasm. Cells can make lactic acid. A second kind of fermentation evolves in the cytoplasm. Cells, all anaerobic, can now convert pyruvate, the final product of glycolysis, into ethanol. Active transport evolves. Proteins and ATP are used to transport molecules into and out of the cytoplasm. The prokaryote flagellum evolves. Prokaryote cells now have more mobility and can make more choices about their location. Archaea, also called archaebacteria, evolve according to genetic comparison. The phylum nanoarchaeota, eubacteria and archaea are the two major lines of prokaryotes. The eubacteria hyperthermophiles evolve, the ancestor of Aquifex and Thermatoga, the archaea phylum crenarchaeota, the ancestor of Cephalobus, the archaea phylum Euryarchaeota evolve, the ancestor of methanogens and halobacteria, the earliest cell response to light, the first autotrophic cells, cells that can produce some of their own food. Autotrophs produce their own sugars, lipids, and amino acids. Photosynthesis. Bacteria use light particles to convert carbon dioxide gas and an electron donor, also called a reductant, like hydrogen sulfide, into glucose, water, and sulfur. This process of moving carbon from carbon dioxide gas to the hydrocarbon molecule glucose is called carbon fixation. This is the ancestor of photosystem 1. This system of photosynthesis does not liberate oxygen. Photosynthesis photosystem 2 evolves. Cells emit free oxygen. Bacteria use light particles to convert carbon dioxide gas and water into glucose, releasing oxygen gas in the process. This is the main system responsible for producing the oxygen now in the air of Earth. The end of the Hadean and start of the Archean eon. Filamentous multicellularity evolves in prokaryotes. Photosynthetic bacteria grow in filaments. Cells stay fastened together after cell division. Multicellularity appears to have evolved independently multiple times in the history of life on Earth. Cell differentiation evolves in filamentous prokaryotes, creating organisms with different kinds of cells. Nitrogen fixation evolves. Cells can make nitrogen compounds like ammonia from nitrogen gas in the air. Nitrogen-fixing bacteria play an important role in allowing plants to obtain nitrogen from nitrogen gas in the air. Nitrogen is needed to make proteins and nucleic acids. Aerobic cellular respiration. The first aerobic or oxygenic cell. These cells use oxygen to convert glucose into carbon dioxide, water, and ATP. The oldest physical evidence for life, the ratio of carbon-13 to carbon-12 in grains of ancient appetite, which are calcium phosphate minerals. Life uses the lighter carbon-12 isotope, and so the ratio of carbon-12 to carbon-13 is different from a non-living source, such as calcium carbonate or limestone. The oldest sediment, the banded iron formation, begins. Banded iron formation is sedimentary rock that spans from 3.8 to 1.8 billion years ago, made of iron-rich silicates like silicon dioxide with alternating layers of black-colored reduced or ferrous iron and red-colored oxidized or ferric iron. These alternating layers represent a seasonal cycle where the quantity of free oxygen in the ocean rises and falls, possibly linked to photosynthetic organisms. The atmosphere of Earth still has only small amounts of oxygen at this time. The oldest fossil evidence of life, stromatolites. The oldest fossils of an organism. The organism is similar to cyanobacteria and is found in the 3,500 million year old chert, sedimentary rock made of silica, in Australia and South Africa. 2.8 billion years will pass before the first animal evolves. The earliest fossils of coccoid, spherical bacteria. Prokaryote reproduction by budding. The earliest acrotarch fossils, unicellular microfossils with uncertain affinity. These acrotarchs are also the earliest possible eukaryote fossils. The eubacteria phylum formicutes evolves. Gram-positive bacteria, the cause of botulism, tetanus, and anthrax. The first endospores evolve in Formicutes. An endospore is a tough reduced dry form of a bacterium triggered by a lack of nutrients that protects the bacterium and allows it to be revived after long periods of time. The Eubacteria phylum Proteobacteria evolves, includes Rickettsia, the ancestor of all mitochondria, Gonorrhea, Salmonella, and Escherichia coli, or E. coli. Gender and sex conjugation evolve in Escherichia coli bacteria. Conjugation is the exchange of DNA plasmids by a donor male bacterium through a P list to a recipient female bacterium. In addition to pili and conjugation, proteins that can cut DNA and other proteins that can connect two strands of DNA evolve. The first virus evolves. These cells depend on the DNA duplicating in protein production systems of other cells to reproduce themselves. 
The first viruses may be made from bacteria or may be bacteria initially. The Eubacteria phylum Planktomycetes, also known as Planktobacteria, evolves. The Eubacteria phylum Actinobacteria evolves, the source of streptomycin and the cause of tuberculosis and leprosy. The Eubacteria phylum Spirochetes evolves, the cause of syphilis and Lyme disease. The Eubacteria phylum Bacteroidetes evolves. The Eubacteria phylum Chlamydiae evolves. The Eubacteria phylum Chlorobi evolves, green sulfur bacteria. The Eubacteria phylum Verrucomicrobia evolves. Endo and exocytosis evolve. Cells can now eat other cells. Endocytosis is a process of cellular ingestion by which the plasma membrane folds inward to bring substances into the cell. Exocytosis is a process of cellular secretion or excretion in which substances contained in vesicles are released from the cell by fusion of the vesicle membrane with the outer cell membrane. The eukaryotic cell evolves, the first cell with a nucleus, the first protist. The nucleus may develop from the infolding of plasma membrane. There are some differences between prokaryotic and eukaryotic cells. In prokaryotic cells, the DNA is concentrated in a region that is not membrane enclosed, called the nucleoid, while in eukaryotic cells, most of the DNA is contained in a nucleus that is bounded by a double membrane. Eukaryotic cells are generally much larger than prokaryotic cells. Typical bacteria are between 1.5 micrometers in diameter, while eukaryotic cells are typically 10 to 100 micrometers in diameter. Unlike prokaryotic cells, eukaryotic cells have a cytoskeleton. The cytoskeleton enables eukaryotic cells to change their shape and to surround and engulf other cells. Eukaryotic cells also have internal structures that prokaryotic cells lack, such as mitochondria and plastids. DNA in prokaryotic cells is usually in the form of a single circular chromosome, while DNA in the nucleus of eukaryotes contains linear chromosomes. Like prokaryotes, this cell is probably haploid, has a single unique DNA. Most eukaryotes are diploid, having two sets of DNA. All protists, fungi, animals, and plant cells descend from this common eukaryotic cell. The earliest molecular fossil evidence of eukaryotes, sterane molecules. Steranes are formed by sterols, molecules made by mitochondria. The endoplasmic reticulum evolves in a eukaryotic cell. The endoplasmic reticulum is a membrane system that extends from the nucleus important in the synthesis of proteins and lipids. The cytoskeleton forms in the eukaryote cytoplasm. The eukaryote flagellum and cilia evolve. Unlike the prokaryote flagella that rotate, the flagella and cilia of eukaryotic cells undulate in a wave-like motion to propel the cell. The eukaryote cilia and flagella are structurally the same. The sperm cells of algae, animals, and some plants have flagella. The circular chromosome in the eukaryote nucleus changes into linear chromosomes, although the eukaryotic cell may have descended from a prokaryote that already had linear DNA. Histones evolve. Histones are proteins found in all eukaryotic cell nuclei that package and order a single continuous DNA molecule into structural units called nucleosomes. The eukaryote cell evolves two intermediate stages between cell division and DNA synthesis. In prokaryotes, DNA synthesis takes place uninterrupted between cell divisions, but eukaryotes duplicate their DNA exactly once during a discrete period between cell divisions. The eukaryote Golgi apparatus evolves. The Golgi apparatus packages proteins and lipids into vesicles for delivery to targeted destinations. The nucleolus evolves. The nucleolus is a sphere in the nucleus that makes ribosomes. Mitosis evolves in eukaryote cells. Mitosis is the process in eukaryotic cell division in which the duplicated chromosomes are separated and the nucleus divides resulting in two new nuclei, each of which contains an identical copy of the parental chromosomes. Mitosis is usually immediately followed by cytokinesis, the division of the cytoplasm. Eukaryote sex evolves. This is the first diploid cell and the first zygote. Because of sex, two cells with different DNA can mix, providing more genetic variety. Having two chromosome sets also provides a backup copy of important genes. All sexual species alternate between haploid and diploid. There are three main different types of sexual life cycles, haplontic, haplodiplontic, and diplontic. This begins the haplontic life cycle. In the entire life cycle, mitosis only occurs in the haploid phase. The only diploid cell is the zygote. This fusion of two haploid cells results in the first diploid single-celled organism, which may then immediately divide back to two haploid cells. Initially, sex may be the fusion of two indistinguishable cells, isogamy, with gender, anisogamy, only evolving later, although possibly eukaryote cell fusion and gender is directly descended from prokaryote conjugation. 
Meiosis evolves. One-step meiosis, a single cell division of a diploid cell into two haploid cells. Meiosis, which looks similar to mitosis, is the process of cell division in sexually reproducing organisms that reduces the number of chromosomes in reproductive cells from diploid to haploid, leading to the production of gametes in animals and spores in plants. Without the reduction back to haploid, genomes would double in size with every generation. Gender in eukaryotes evolves. An isogamy, sex, cell and nucleus fusion between two cells that are different in size or shape. Oogamy, a form of an isogamy, evolves in protists. Sex between a flagellated gamete and an unflagellated gamete. Two-step meiosis, diploid DNA copies and then the cell divides twice into four haploid cells. Most protists divide by two-step meiosis and one-step meiosis is rare. The Eubacteria phylum Deinococcus thermus evolves, includes Thermus aquaticus, used in PCR, and Deinococcus radiodurans, which can survive long exposure to radiation. The Eubacteria phylum Cyanobacteria evolves. Cyanobacteria are the only prokaryotes with oxygen-producing photosynthesis and are the ancestor of all eukaryote plastids, for example chloroplasts. The Eubacteria phylum Chloroflexi evolves, green non-sulfur bacteria, the end of the Archean and start of the Proterozoic eon. The Proterozoic spans from 2,500 to 542 million years ago and represents 42% of Earth's history. Bacteria live on land. Start of a 200 million year ice age. The oldest red beds, iron oxide formed on land, begin here and are also evidence of more free oxygen in the air of Earth. A parasitic bacterium closely related to Rickettsia prowazeki, an aerobic proteobacteria, is engulfed by an early eukaryotic cell. Over time, a symbiotic relationship evolves within the eukaryotic cell, an endosymbiosis, where the Rickettsia becomes mitochondria. Mitochondria are membrane-bound organelles found in the cytoplasm of almost all eukaryotic cells and are where cellular respiration occurs, producing most of the ATP in a eukaryotic cell. The earliest large filamentous fossil, Grypania. Grypania spiralis is about 10 centimeters long and is thought to be either a green alga or large cyanobacterium. If eukaryote, Grypania would be the earliest eukaryote fossil. The end of the banded iron formation. The first homeobox genes evolve. These genes regulate the building of major body parts in algae, plants, fungi, and animals. For example, when a homeobox gene responsible for growing a mouse eye is added to the cell of a fruit fly embryo that is destined to be a leg, an extra fruit fly eye is built on the leg. The ancestor of all living eukaryotes divides into bicont and unicont descendants. Bicons lead to all chromalveolates, excavates rhizaria and plants. Unicons lead to all amoebozoa, animals and fungi. The protist phylum amoebozoa evolves. Amoebas, slime molds. Feeding using pseudopods evolves. Protists opisthocons, ancestor of fungi, coenoflagellates and animals. The first plastids evolve. Cyanobacteria form plastids through endosymbiosis within a eukaryotic cell. Like mitochondria, these organelles copy themselves and are not made by the cell DNA. Plastids provide the eukaryotic cell with food from photosynthesis and gain protection by living within the cell. Filamentous multicellularity in eukaryotes evolves. In this organism, unlike single-cell eukaryotes, cells stay fastened together after cell division. Multicellularity seems to have arisen multiple times independently in eukaryotes. Differentiation in a multicellular eukaryote evolves. In addition to gamete, or spore cells, there are somatic cells. Unlike gamete cells, somatic cells are asexual, non-fusing. This is the start of death by aging. Cell differentiation is how cells in a multicellular organism become specialized to perform specific functions in a variety of tissues and organs. The first plant, ancestor of all green and red algae and land plants. This begins the plant kingdom. The first plant is probably unicellular, similar to the glaucophytes. The earliest extant plant, Glaucophyta. Glaucophytes are unicellular algae found in freshwater. The plant phylum Rhodophyta evolves. Red algae. The haplodiplontic life cycle evolves. Mitosis occurs in both haploid and diploid life stages. The protists excavates, includes parabasalids and diplomonads like Giardia. Mitosis of diploid cells evolves. A captured red alga through endosymbiosis becomes a plastid in the ancestor of all chromalveolates. This is a secondary plastid endosymbiosis where an algae cell is captured instead of a cyanobacterium. The protists chromalveolates evolve, ancestor of the chromista, cryptophytes, haptophytes, and strominopolis, and alveolates. The earliest certain eukaryote fossils and eukaryote filamentous multicellularity, rhodophyta, red algae fossils.
The plant phylum Chlorophyta evolves. Green algae, ancestor of Volvox, sea lettuce, Spirogyra, and stoneworts. The first land plants most likely evolve from green algae. The first fungi. This begins the fungi kingdom. Like animals, fungi are heterotrophic, unable to build structural materials by photosynthesis, and so must feed on other living things. Fungi live on organic material and are therefore generally parasitic, live or feed on another organism to the detriment of the host organism, or are saprophytic, live on dead or decaying organic matter. Some types of fungi, however, form symbioses with plants. The protists alveolates, ancestor of all ciliates, apicomplexans, and dinoflagellates. The oldest extant fungi phylum, Microsporidia, evolves. Microsporidia are obligate, survive only as intracellular parasites of eukaryotes. The protist phylum Dinoflagellata evolves, the dinoflagellates. The excavates Dyschychristates, the ancestor of protists which have mitochondria with discoidal shaped cristae, includes euglenids, leishmanias, trypanosomes, and acrasid slime molds. A eukaryote eye evolves, the first three-dimensional response to light. The earliest eye probably evolves from a plastid. The first proto-eye is a light-sensitive area in a unicellular eukaryote. Eukaryotes are the first organisms to evolve the ability to follow light direction in three dimensions in open water. Colonialism, where cells form a colony, evolves for the first time in eukaryotes. The protists, Stromanopoles, also called heterocons, evolve. Ancestor of all brown algae, golden algae, diatoms, and oomycota. The protists, Mesomycetozoa, evolve, also called drips. The protist phylum Oomycota evolves, ancestor of the oomycetes, water molds. The protists Rhizaria evolve, ancestor of all Radiolaria, Foraminifera, and Circozoa. The fungi Zygomycota evolves, ancestor of the bread molds and pin molds. The protist phylum Ciliophora evolves, the ciliates, ancestor of the Paramecium. The protist phylum Apicomplexa evolves, includes malaria and toxoplasmosis. The protists Coenoflagellates evolve. Coenoflagellates are the closest relatives to the animals and may be direct ancestors of sponges. Multicellularity evolves in a free-moving protist. This allows larger free-moving organisms to evolve. This multicellularity is thought to be independently evolved and not related to the earlier filamentous multicellularity of prokaryotes like cyanobacteria and eukaryotes like algae. The diplontic life cycle evolves. This organism is predominantly diploid. Mitosis in the haploid phase does not occur. All animals are diplontic and descend from this multicellular organism. The first animal in the first metazoan, the sponge, evolves. This begins the animal kingdom in the phylum periphera, the sponges. There are only three major kinds of metazoans, sponges, cnidarians, and bilaterians. The word periphera means pore bearing in Latin, and water continuously flows through the pores and sponges. Metazoans are multicellular and have differentiation, their cells perform different functions. Sponges have cells that form a body wall, cells that secrete the skeleton, contractile cells, cells that digest food, and other kinds of cell types. All sponge shells are totipotent and so are capable of regrowing a new sponge. Sponges have two layers, each a single cell thick. The outer surface is called the pinacoderm and is made of cells called pinacocytes. On the inner surface is the coenoderm, which is made of flagellated cells called coenocytes. Between these two thin cellular sheets is the jelly-like mesa hyle. Some sponges can live for over 1,000 years. The male gonad, testis or testicle, evolves in a sponge. In sponges, sperm are contained in spermatic cysts, which are coanocyte chambers transformed by the formation of sperm, spermatogenesis, but ova are distributed throughout the mesa hyle, or middle layer. Cells that group as tissues that are arranged in layers evolve in metazoans. Unlike the periphera, in the placozoa and all later metazoans, cells group as tissues. Start of the 60 million year Varanger Ice Age. The metazoa phylum Placozoa evolves. Placozoans look like amoebas but are multicellular. The only known species is Trichoplax adherens. Trichoplax lives in the sea and feeds on single-celled organisms, mostly algae. There are only four cell types in Trichoplax compared to the more than 200 cell types in humans. Trichoplax has two main cell layers like a cnidarian or tenophore. Between these two layers are a few contractile cells that are similar to muscle cells, however placozoans have no muscle or nerve cells. The fungi Chytridiomycota evolves, includes all chytridiomycetes. The chytrids are primitive fungi and are mostly subprobic, feed on dead species, decomposing chitin and keratin. Many chytrids are aquatic, mostly found in freshwater. The first nerve cell or neuron and nervous system evolves in the ancestor of the tenophores and cnidarians. This leads to the first ganglion and brain. 
This is the earliest touch and sound detection. As time continues in the evolution of the metazoans, the number of neurons increases while the size of neurons decreases just like transistors as computers improve. Muscle cells evolve in metazoans. Both the earliest known muscle and nerve cells are found in tenophores and cnidarians. Tenophores move by cilia, but cnidarians move by muscle contraction. However, cnidaria lack true muscle cells. Their muscle fibers are always extensions of an epithelial or skin cell. Tenophores have true muscle cells. A closable mouth evolves in the ancestor of all tenophores and cnidarians. The female gonad, the first ovary, evolves in the ancestor of tenophores and cnidarians. In cnidarians, gonads develop in the body wall or in the mesenteries, cavities created by folded tissue, by differentiation of interstitial cells, cells in the space between tissues. Cnidaria have no complex reproductive organs. The animal phylum Tenophora evolves. Comb jellies. Like the cnidarians, the tenophores are diploblastic. They have two embryonic germ layers, the ectoderm and the endoderm, which become the adult epidermis and gastrodermis, respectively. The middle mesenchyme, a watery gelatinous fluid, never produces the complex organs seen in triploblastic metazoa. The main body cavity of the tenophores is also the digestive chamber, and they have a simple nerve net. Hair-like cilia propel the tenophora instead of the pulsating muscles which propel jellyfish. The start of the Ediacaran period. The animal phylum Cnidaria evolves, the ancestor of sea anemones, sea pens, corals, and jellyfish. Cnidaria also evolve the earliest animal eye. Cnidaria are primarily radially symmetrical animals with tentacles, have a single body cavity with only one opening to take in food and to release wastes, and have specialized stinging cells. Cnidarians have two alternate body plans, the polyp and the medusa. A sea anemone is an example of a polyp, fixed to the ground with mouth on top. A coral is a polyp that secretes a skeleton which it lives inside of. The medusa form is upside down compared to the polyp form and is free swimming. A jellyfish has a typical medusa form. The start of the Ediacaran soft-bodied invertebrate fossils. The sudden appearance of Ediacaran fossils may relate to the accumulation of free oxygen in the atmosphere and sea, which may permit an oxidative metabolism. From around 600 to 560 million years ago, simple medusoid and frond fossils are found. Then after 555 million years ago, tubular and bilaterian fossils are found. Because the Ediacaran animals are soft-bodied, they are infrequently preserved. The animals bilaterians evolve. Metazoans with two-sided symmetry. This is the first tripoblastic animal, an animal with a third embryonic layer, the mesoderm. This is also the earliest animal brain and memory. In most bilaterians, food enters in one end, the mouth, and waste exits at the opposite end, the anus. There is an advantage for sense organs like light, sound, touch, smell, and taste detection to be located on the head near the mouth to help with getting food. The earliest brain, ganglion, and memory develop in a bilaterian worm. This begins the animal subkingdom, Bilateria. The earliest extant Bilaterian, Acelomorpha, ancestor of Acela flatworms and Nemerta dermatita. The Acelomorpha lack a digestive tract, anus, and coelom. Flatworms have no lungs or gills and breathe through their skin. With no circulating blood, their branched gut presumably transports nutrients to all parts of their body. An intestine evolves in a bilaterian. Since the gut of this organism has no anus, undigested food must be regurgitated through the mouth. A cylindrical gut, anus, and throughput of food evolves in a bilaterian, found in all bilaterians except Acelomorpha and Platyhelminthes. The genital pore, vagina, and uterus evolve in a bilaterian. The penis evolves in a bilaterian. Bilaterian. The end of the Faringer Ice Age. The coelom evolves in a bilaterian. The coelom is a fluid-filled cavity that forms within the mesoderm and exists between the gut and body wall in most tripoblastic animals. The advantage of a coelom is that it allows the body wall and gut wall to act independently, and also that other organ systems can be developed in the fluid-filled space. In addition, the fluid in the cavity can act as a deformable skeleton. The first circulatory system evolves. Blood vessels and blood evolve in a bilaterian. The first blood cells. Cnidarians and flatworms are at most two sheets of tissue thick and so allow gas exchange and nutrient distribution by diffusion. But larger animals with thicker tissues require a circulatory system to distribute materials. The circulatory system transports molecules like gases, foods, and waste to and from individual cells. The bilaterians' protostomes evolve, the ancestor of all ectozoa and lophotrochozoa. 
The difference between protostomes and deuterostomes arises during embryonic development. In protostomes, the first indentation of the gastrula, an early stage of the embryo, develops into the mouth and the second indentation develops into the anus. The reverse is true for the deuterostomes. The bilaterians deuterostomes evolve. The ancestor of all echinoderms, hemichordates, and chordates. The first shell, or skeleton, evolves. The first known shell belongs to a group of ciliates called tintinids. Skeletons evolve independently in different groups of organisms. The bilaterians ketognatha evolve. Arrowworms. The earliest teeth evolve. Animals start to eat other animals. The evolution of teeth and animal predation starts an arms race that rapidly transforms ecosystems around the earth teeth and shells evolve as advantages to survival. The deuterostome phylum hemichordata evolves, the hemichordates, the ancestor of terebranchs and acorn worms. Adult terebranchs are sessile, fastening to solid structures, but the younger or larval form is free swimming and is thought to have evolved into tunicates and then the first fish. The deuterostome phylum chordata evolves. Chordates are a very large group that includes all tunicates, fishes, amphibians, reptiles, mammals, and birds. Chordates get their name from the notochord, the cartilage rod that runs along the back of the animal, in the embryo, if not in the adult. The ancestor of all chordates evolves upside down. Unlike earlier invertebrates who have a ventral nerve cord near the belly and a dorsal heart near the back, this ancestor and all later vertebrates have a dorsal nerve cord and a ventral heart. The earliest extant chordate tunicates evolve, also called sea squirts. The earliest animal shell or skeleton evolves. This is the earliest evidence of animals eating other animals, predation. This begins the appearance of small shelly fossils and deep burrows correlated with a decline in stromatolites, possibly from feeding. The earliest animal shells are made by tiny organisms with simple tube-like skeletons, such as claudina and cyanotubulites, in addition to sponge skeleton fossils. The shell of claudina is made of calcium carbonate and possibly made by some kind of worm. Predatory boreholes have been found in claudina shells. This is the oldest evidence of predation known. The protostomes ectisozoa evolve. Ectisozoa are animals that molt, lose their outer skin as they grow. This is the ancestor of roundworms and arthropods, which includes insects and crustaceans, also known as shellfish. The protostomes Lepha trachozoa evolve. Ancestor of rotifers, pheronids, brachiopods, entoprox, bryozoans, platyhelminthes, gastrotrix, nemertia, mollusks, and annelids. The first fish evolves. The earliest extant fish, the chordates lancelets, also called amphioxus. This is also the first liver and kidney. Lancelets are the most primitive chordates to have a liver and a kidney, which are not found in hemichordates or tunicates. The ectisozoa ascalminthes evolves, the ancestor of the worms nematodes and preapulids. The lephatrachozoa phylum brachiopoda evolves, the brachiopods. The brachiopods are marine invertebrates that have bivalve dorsal and ventral shells enclosing a pair of tentacled arm-like structures that are used to sweep minute food particles into their mouth. Segmentation evolves, body parts are repeated serially. The lephatrachozoa phylum bryozoa evolves, the bryozoans or moss animals. Bryozoans are tiny animals that grow in colonies that look like branches. The end of the Precambrian. The end of the Proterozoic and start of the Phanerozoic Eon. The end of the Neoproterozoic and start of the Paleozoic Era and the end of the Ediacaran and start of the Cambrian period. The Cambrian radiation, or Cambrian explosion, the rapid diversification of multicellular animals between 542 and 530 million years ago that results in the appearance of many between 20 and 35 of the major phyla of animals, an increase of animals with shells. The Cambrian metazoan radiation may be the result of a major increase in atmospheric oxygen and animal predation. The Lephatrachozoa phylum platyhelminthes evolves, flatworms. The protist phylum radiolaria, ocean protists, many with silica shells. The protist phylum foraminifera evolves, unicellular protists with fine pseudopods that extend from a cytoplasm body encased within a calcium carbonate shell. The Lephatrachozoa phylum nemertia evolves, ribbon worms. The ectisozoa phylum tardigrada evolves, tardigrades. The ectisozoa phylum anacophora evolves. Anacophorans are a transition between worms and arthropods. They have segmented worm-like bodies, but they also have jointed appendages, antennae, and shed their cuticle like arthropods do. 
The first heart evolves in bilaterians. Muscles for pumping blood and for maintaining adequate blood pressure can be divided into three groups. Contractile blood vessels, found in nemertians and annelids, osseate hearts, found in arthropods, and chambered hearts, found in mollusks and vertebrates. The Lafa trachozoophyllum mollusca evolves. Mollusks. The phylum mollusca is the second largest animal phylum after the arthropods and is divided into seven classes, three of which, gastropoda, snails, bivalvia, clams and mussels, and cephalopoda, squids and octopuses, are of major importance. The Lafa trachozoophyllum annelida evolves. Segmented worms. Annelids are various worms or worm-like animals characterized by an elongated cylindrical segmented body and includes the earthworm and leech. The Ectisozoophyllum arthropoda evolves, the arthropods. Arthropods can be compared to a segmented worm encased in a rigid exoskeleton. The phylum arthropoda is the largest phylum in the animal kingdom. Arthropods include the trilobites, the crustaceans, shrimps, crabs, and lobsters, the myriapoda, centipedes and millipedes, the chelicerata, arachnids and horseshoe crabs, and the insects. All arthropods have a segmented body covered by an exoskeleton containing chitin, which serves as both armor and as a surface for muscle attachment. The chordata vertebrates evolve. This subphylum vertebrata contains most fishes and all amphibians, reptiles, mammals, and birds. The characteristic features of the vertebrata are a vertebral column or backbone and a cranium, which protect the central nervous system, brain and spinal cord, and major sense organs. This earliest vertebrate skeleton is made completely of cartilage. The vertebrate's jawless fishes evolve, Agnatha. Some extinct jawless fishes that live in the Devonian age of fishes, such as the astrocoderms, will have hard bony armor plating. The arthropods Chelicerata evolve. Eight legs, ancestor of the horseshoe crabs, sea spiders, and the arachnids, mites, spiders, and scorpions. The earliest color vision evolves in arthropods. The deuterostome phylum Echinodermata evolves. The echinoderms, the ancestor of the sea cucumbers, sea urchins, sand dollars, and starfishes. The arthropods trilobites evolve. Trilobites have a segmented body that is divided into three vertical lobes. There is a transition from the soft-bodied organisms to the clam-like shell organisms to the segmented calcite and chitin shells of the trilobites. The arthropods crustaceans evolve, the ancestor of all shrimps, crabs, lobsters, and barnacles. The arthropods myriapoda evolve, the ancestor of all centipedes and millipedes. The end of the Cambrian and start of the Ordovician period. The Ordovician radiation. During the Ordovician, the number of genera will quadruple. The nonvascular plants evolve. Bryophyta, ancestor of the liverworts, hornworts, and mosses. The bryophytes are the simplest land plants and reproduce with spores. Plants live on land. The earliest fossil spores belonging to land plants. Plants conquer land before animals do, and like animals may move to land not by sea but by freshwater. The first animals live on land, the arthropods myriapoda, centipedes and millipedes. Jawed vertebrates evolve, nathostomata. This large group includes all jawed fishes, amphibians, reptiles, mammals, and birds. The first vertebrate teeth. The jaw evolves from parts of the gill skeleton. The jawed fishes chondrichthyes, cartilaginous fishes, ancestor of all sharks, rays, skates, and sawfishes. The earliest fungi on land, the ancestor of all terrestrial fungi, glomeromycota, ascomycota, and basidiomycota. The fungi phylum glomeromycota evolves, arbuscular mycorrhizal fungi, the end or division mass extinction. This is caused by an ice age. This is the first of five mass extinctions in the Phanerozoic, the end of the Ordovician and the start of the Silurian period. The vascular plants evolve, the phylum Tracheophyta. Vascular plants have a specialized conducting system consisting mostly of phloem, food conducting tissue, and xylem, water conducting tissue, collectively called vascular tissue. The jawed fishes, bony fishes evolve, Osteichthyes, the ancestor of the ray fin, lobe fin, and lung fishes. Bony fishes have a skeleton that is at least partly ossified or made of bone. The bony fishes are the ancestor of the tetrapods who will ultimately move onto land. The earliest bony fishes are the ray finned fishes. The first lung evolves from the swim bladder in ray finned fishes. Some teleosts still use their swim bladder for breathing out of water. The jawed fishes, lobe finned fishes evolve. Lobe finned fishes have a fleshy lobe at the base of each fin. The arthropods, hexapods, arthropods with six legs, three pairs, the ancestor of all insects. The Chelicerata arachnids evolve, the ancestor of all scorpions, spiders, mites, and ticks. The lobe fin fishes, lung fishes evolve, the end of the Silurian and start of the Devonian period. The hexapods insects evolve, 
the most primitive extant insects the bristletails evolve now. The insect's silverfish, the largest fungi phylum Ascomycota evolves, the ancestor of yeasts, truffles, penicillium, and morels. The vascular plants' ferns evolve, the ancestor of club mosses, ferns, and horsetails. Ferns are flowerless, seedless, vascular plants that have roots, stems, and fronds, the leaf-like part of a fern, and reproduce by spores. The cartilaginous fish's subclass Elasmobranchii evolves, the ancestor of sharks, dogfishes, skates, and rays. The green algae carophytes evolve, stoneworts, the earliest fungi lichen. A lichen is a fungus, usually of the class Ascomycetes, that grows symbiotically with algae and cyanobacteria, resulting in a composite organism that characteristically forms a crust-like or branching growth on rocks or tree trunks. The cartilaginous fishes Salachii evolve, the ancestor of all sharks, including great white, hammerhead, mako, tiger, and nurse sharks. The cartilaginous fishes Holocephaly evolve, the ancestor of the chimeras, also called rabbit fishes or rat fishes. The first forests, the earliest large tree fossils. The first flying animal, an arthropod insect, the ancestor of all winged insects, Terragota. The earliest extant winged insects are the Ephemeroptera, mayflies, and the Odonata, dragonflies and damselflies. Insect wings evolve only once, and all winged insects descend from the first winged insect. The development of wings may have helped early insects to escape predators and to move over larger distances to find new habitats. The first tetrapods, vertebrates with four feet, evolve in freshwater. These are the first vertebrate limbs, arms and legs, and fingers. This is also the first amphibian, the ancestor of Sicilians, frogs, toads, and salamanders. The late Devonian mass extinction, caused by an ice age. The first vertebrates live on land, an amphibian. The second largest fungi phylum, Basidiomycota, evolves. The ancestor of many mushrooms, Button, Chanterelle, Crimini, Inaki, Fly Agaric, Oyster, Porcino, Portabella, Psilocybe, Puffball, Shiitake, Wood Ear, Rusts and Club Fungi. The Neoptera, folding wing insects evolve. A mechanism to fold the wings against the body after landing has a selective advantage by making the wings less conspicuous, awkward, and susceptible to breakage. All higher orders of insects evolve from the Neoptera. The end of the Devonian and start of the Carboniferous period. The first seed plant evolves, the ancestor of all seed plants. The earliest fossil seed is from a seed fern, pteridosperm. Fossils indicate that the first seed evolves from an enclosing ring of vegetative lobes that fuse together. Hearing in amphibians adapts to sounds transmitted through the air. This is the beginning of vertebrates making vocal sounds. The ray-finned fishes, sturgeons, and paddlefish evolve. The Neoptera dictyoptera evolve, the ancestor of cockroaches, termites, and mantises. The first hard-shell egg. The tetrapods amniota evolve, the ancestor of all reptiles, mammals, and birds, and the first hard-shell egg. The hard shell egg is waterproof. This is the start of vertebrate internal fertilization because on land the egg cannot be fertilized as most fishes and amphibians do by a male swimming near the eggs and spraying them with sperm. Amniote males and females must copulate so that the sperm can reach the eggs inside the female. All living amniotes lay hard shelled eggs except most mammals and some snakes and lizards where egg laying has been replaced by live birth. The eggshell of amniotes may be flexible, like the eggs of many lizards, or mineralized and hard, like the eggs of birds. The amniota divide into the sauropsida and the synapsida. The sauropsids have two major lineages, the para-reptilia, turtles, and the eureptilia, dinosaurs, crocodiles, and birds. The synapsids also have two major lineages, the pelicosaurs, which are sail-backed amniotes, and the therapsids, which are mammal-like amniotes. The synapsids pelicosauria evolve, the ancestor of Adaphosaurus and Dimetrodon. The earliest extant amphibians, Sicilians evolve. The seed plants, Gymnosperms evolve. Gymnosperms are the most primitive extant seed plants and ancestor of all cycads, ginkgos, and the conifers. The most primitive extant gymnosperms, the cycads evolve now. Gymnosperm is Greek for naked seed. A gymnosperm reproduces by a seed that is in direct contact with the environment, as opposed to an angiosperm whose seeds are enclosed by fruits. The Neoptera orthoptera evolve, the ancestor of crickets, grasshoppers, locusts, and walking sticks. The Sauropsids reptilia evolve, the reptiles, the ancestor of all turtles, crocodiles, pterosaurs, dinosaurs, and birds. Reptiles are a group of air-breathing amniotes with internal fertilization and scales covering part or all of their body. 
All reptiles are cold-blooded, except for birds and possibly some or all pterosaurs and dinosaurs. The gymnosperms Pinophyta evolve, the ancestor of the conifers, includes pine, fir, spruce, redwood, cedar, juniper, hemlock, larch, yew, and cypress. The Neoptera Paraneoptera evolve, the ancestor of bark lice, true lice, thrips, and the hemiptera. The hemiptera have mouthparts adapted for piercing and sucking and include cicadas, aphids, and true bugs such as bed bugs and stink bugs. The Neoptera Holometabola evolve, holometabolous insects, insects that undergo complete metamorphosis. The ancestor of beetles, bees, true flies, and butterflies. The holometabolous insects account for nearly 85% of all insects. The holometabola are insects that have complete metamorphosis or holometabolous development. Unlike hemimetabolous insects in which the immature structures, legs, eyes, antennae, etc. must also serve the adults, holometabolous insects have a morphologically reduced larval stage and acquire a completely new body during the pupal stage. The amphibians Anura evolve, the ancestor of all frogs and toads. The Stromonopolis chrysophyta evolve, golden algae, the end of the Carboniferous and start of the Permian period. The Holometabola coleoptera evolve, the ancestor of the beetles, gymnosperms, ginkgos. The Holometabola hymenoptera evolve, the ancestor of all bees, ants, and wasps. The synapsid therapsids evolve, cynodonts. The Stromonopolis pheophyta evolve, the ancestor of all brown algae, includes many seaweeds like the giant kelps. Note that brown algae are not plants, but are protists. The Stromonopolis diatoms evolve, the earliest endothermic or warm-blooded and hair-growing animal, a therapsid. Endothermy is the physiological maintenance by a body of a constant temperature independent of the external environmental temperature. Hair for insulation is correlated to endothermy. Both birds and mammals are endothermic, also called warm-blooded, as opposed to other vertebrates like amphibians and crocodiles which are ectothermic or cold-blooded and cannot internally generate heat. Endothermy allows birds and mammals to maintain a high and relatively constant body temperature even at rest during a wide range of external environmental conditions. The Holometabola diptera evolve, true flies, having a single pair of wings, the ancestor of the mosquito, gnat, fruit fly, and house fly. The largest mass extinction of history, the end Permian mass extinction. 82% of all genera are observed extinct. The end of the Paleozoic and start of the Mesozoic era, and the end of the Permian and start of the Triassic period. The supercontinent Pangaea forms. The protist phylum Haptophyta evolves. The Coccolithophores. The reptiles Dinosaurs evolve. Dinosaurs divide into two major lines, the Ornithischians, bird-hipped dinosaurs, and the Sariscians, lizard-hipped dinosaurs. The Sariscian dinosaurs split into two major lines, the Sauropodomorpha and the Theropoda. The sauropodomorphs are divided into prosauropods and sauropods are mostly plant-eating and include the large, long-necked dinosaurs like Apatosaurus. The theropod dinosaurs are bipedal and carnivorous and include Allosaurus, Tyrannosaurus, and Velociraptor. All birds descend from a theropod ancestor. The synapsids mammals evolve. The first nipple, mammary gland, and breast. The ray-finned fishes teleost fishes evolve. Teleosts are a large group of fishes with bony skeletons, including most common fishes. The most primitive extant reptiles, the Testudines, evolve. The ancestor of all turtles, tortoises, and terrapins. The reptiles, Tuataras, evolve. The first flying vertebrate, the reptiles, Pterosaurs, evolve. The reptiles, Iguania, evolve. The ancestor of iguanas, chameleons, and spiny lizards. The reptiles, Scleroglossa, evolve. The ancestor of snakes, skinks, and geckos. The earliest extant teleosts, bony tongues evolve. Mass extinction, the end Triassic mass extinction. 53% of all genera are observed extinct. Many terrestrial vertebrates and large amphibians go extinct. The Ornithischians Thyreophora evolve, the ancestor of the armored ankylosaurs and the plated stegosaurs. The teleosts eels and tarpons evolve. The reptiles Crocodilia evolve, the ancestor of crocodiles, alligators, and caimans. The Sariscian sauropods evolve, the ancestor of the large, long-necked dinosaurs like Apatosaurus, Brachiosaurus, and Diplodocus. The Ornithischian ornithopoda evolve, the duck-billed dinosaurs, ancestor of the hadrosaurs. The teleosts herrings and anchovies evolve. The supercontinent Pangaea splits into Laurasia and Gondwana. The northern part, Laurasia, will form North America and Europe. The southern part, Gondwana, will form South America and Africa. 
The Halometabola lepidoptera evolve, the ancestor of moths, butterflies, and caterpillars. The teleosts carp, minnows, and piranhas evolve. The teleosts salmon, trout, and pike evolve. The amphibians salamanders evolve. The cartilaginous fishes Batoidea evolve, the ancestor of all rays, skates, and sawfishes. The mammals marsupials evolve. The mammals eutheria evolve, placental mammals. The eutheria are mammals that have a placenta. The placenta is an organ that forms in the uterus to aid in the exchange of food and wastes between the blood of the mother and the fetus through an umbilical cord. Placental mammals include all living mammals except marsupials and monotremes. The placenta allows for a longer developmental period within the womb which may give the placentals a selective advantage. Stegosaurus, an armored plant-eating thyreophoran dinosaur, lives around this time. The teleosts, lightfish, and dragonfish evolve. The theropods, birds evolve. The first feather. Fossils of theropod dinosaurs from China indicate that feathers may have originally evolved on non-flying reptiles for insulation or cording and not for flight. At least one known feathered dinosaur can probably glide, which suggests that flapping flight evolves as an extension of gliding from trees. Sauropod dinosaurs are common. Large long-necked dinosaurs like Apatosaurus, Brachiosaurus, and Diplodocus. The seed plants angiosperms evolve, the first flowering plant. Almost all grains, beans, nuts, fruits, vegetables, herbs, and spices come from plants with flowers. Much of our clothing comes from flowering plants too. For example, cotton and linen are made from fibers of flowering plants, as are rope and burlap. Many commercial dyes and drugs also come from flowering plants. Angiosperms represent approximately 80% of all the known green plants now living. The angiosperms are vascular seed plants in which the ovule, or egg, is fertilized and develops into a seed in an enclosed hollow ovary. The ovary is usually enclosed in a flower, the part of the angiosperm that contains the male or female reproductive organs or both. The fruit is the ovary of a plant which encloses seeds. The end of the Jurassic and start of the Cretaceous period. The earliest extant angiosperm, Amborella. The angiosperms Nymphiales evolve, the water lilies. The Ornithischian Ceratopsian dinosaurs evolve, the ancestor of Triceratops. The birds Enantiornithes evolve. The angiosperms Magnoliids evolve, the ancestor of nutmeg, avocado, sassafras, cinnamon, black and white pepper, camphor, bay or laurel tree, and magnolia. The angiosperms Eudicots evolve, the largest lineage of flowers. The two main groups of the eudicots are the rosids and the asterids. Eudicots are also called tricolpates, which refers to the structure of the pollen. The birds Hesper ornithiformes evolve. The teleosts perch, seahorses, flying fish, puffer fish, and barracuda evolve. The teleosts cod and anglerfish evolve. The bird beak evolves. The birds Neornithes evolve, modern birds, the most recent common ancestor of all extant birds. The earliest extant mammals, monotremes evolve. Monotremes are an order of primitive egg-laying mammals restricted to Australia, Tasmania, and New Guinea. The monotremes consist of only the platypus and the echidna. Monotremes are also the most primitive extant warm-blooded and hair-growing species. The angiosperms monocotyledons or monocots evolve flowering plants that have a single cotyledon or seed leaf in the embryo. Monocots are the second largest lineage of flowers after the eudicots and include lilies, palms, orchids, and grasses. The two main orders of monocots are base monocots and camelinids. The basal eudicots evolve, the ancestor of the buttercup, clematis, poppy, macadamia, lotus, and sycamore. The core eudicots evolve, the ancestor of the cactus, caper, buckwheat, rhubarb, venus flytrap, old world pitcher plants, beet, quinoa, spinach, and grape plants. The sauropod Argentinosaurus evolves, possibly the longest animal of all time. The eutheria Afrotheres evolve. Afrotheres originate in Africa and are the earliest extant placental mammals. The birds ratites evolve. The ancestor of the ostrich, emu, cassowary, and kiwi. The theropod Spinosaurus evolves, perhaps the largest meat-eating dinosaur. The Eutheria xenarthrens evolve, the ancestor of sloths, anteaters, and armadillos. The angiosperms rosids evolve. Basal rosids include the pomegranate, clove, guava, allspice, and eucalyptus. The rosids fabales evolve, the ancestor of beans, pea, peanut, soy, and lentil. The monocots base monocots evolve, the ancestor of vanilla, orchid, asparagus, onion, garlic, agave, aloe, and lily. The monocots camelinids evolve, the ancestor of palms, coconut, corn, rice, barley, oat, wheat, rye, sugarcane, bamboo, grass, pineapple, papyrus, turmeric, banana, and ginger. 
the basal asteroids Arachales evolve, the ancestor of the kiwi fruit, ebony, persimmon, blueberry, cranberry, brazil nut, new world pitcher plant, and tea, the asteroids Apiales evolve, the ancestor of dill, celery, cilantro, carrot, parsnip, fennel, parsley, and ivy, the asteroids Asterales evolve, the ancestor of tarragon, daisy, artichoke, sunflower, lettuce, and dandelion, the rosids Malpighiales evolve, the ancestor of coca, rubber tree, cassava, poinsettia, willow, poplar, and aspen. The rosids brassicales evolve. The ancestor of horseradish, mustard, cabbage, broccoli, radish, and papaya. The rosids rosales evolve. The ancestor of hemp, hop, jackfruit, fig, strawberry, rose, raspberry, apple, pear, plum, cherry, peach, and almond. The asteroids gentianales evolve. The ancestor of oleander and coffee. Asterids Solanales evolve, ancestor of bell pepper, tomato, tobacco, potato, and eggplant. The Rosids Cucurbitales evolve, the ancestor of melon, cucumber, pumpkin, squash, and zucchini. The Rosids Fagales evolve, the ancestor of many flowers that produce edible nuts. For example, birch, hazelnut, chestnut, beechnut, oak, walnut, pecan, and hickory. The birds Galliformes evolve. The ancestor of the chicken, turkey, pheasant, peacock, and quail. The birds Anseriformes evolve. The ancestor of ducks, geese, and swans. The Eutheria Laurasia theories evolves. The Laurasia theories are a major line of placental mammals that originate in the northern continent Laurasia. The Rocky Mountains start to form. The Rosids Malvales evolve. The ancestor of okra, marshmallow, durian, cotton, balsa, and cacao. The Rosids Sapindales evolve. The ancestor of the maple, lychee, mahogany, cashew, mango, pistachio, and the citrus trees, orange, lemon, and grapefruit. The ornithopods hadrosaurs evolve, the duck-built dinosaurs. The Laurasia theories insectivora evolves, the ancestor of shrews, moles, and hedgehogs. The theropods dromaeosaurs evolve, raptors. The marsupials new world opossums evolve. The Afro theories aardvarks evolve. The asteroids lamiales evolve, the ancestor of many spices. Mint, basil, marjoram, oregano, rosemary, sage, savory, thyme, teak, sesame, olive, ash, lilac, and jasmine. The marsupials, bandicoots, and bilbies evolve. Two of the largest meat-eating dinosaurs known are common, both theropods. Tyrannosaurus rex is the top predator in North America, and Giganotosaurus is the top predator in South America. The Thyreophoran ankylosaurs evolve, the shieldback and or club-tailed dinosaurs. The marine reptiles mosasaurs evolve. The birds Potocipetiformes evolve. Grebs. The Eutheria, tree shrews, and colugos evolve. The largest pterosaur and largest flying animal ever known, Quetzalcoatlus. The end Cretaceous mass extinction. 47% of all genera are observed extinct. Made extinct are 60% of plant species and all dinosaurs, mosasaurs, pterosaurs, plesiosaurs, and pliosaurs. A comet or meteor collides with the Earth in what is now the Yucatan Peninsula of Mexico and huge amounts of lava erupt from India. No large animals survive on land, in the air, or in the sea. The end of the Mesozoic and start of the Cenozoic era and the end of the Cretaceous and start of the Tertiary period. The start of the rapid diversification of mammals. There is a rapid increase in new species of fossil mammals after the extinction of the dinosaurs. The birds Gruiformes evolve, the ancestor of cranes, rails, and bustards. Marsupial moles evolve, the marsupials Tasmanian devil and numbat evolve. The marsupials Diprotodontia evolve, the ancestor of wombats, kangaroos, possums, and koalas. The primates evolve, the opposable thumb. The order primates contains more than 300 species, including monkeys, apes, and humans. The Andes Mountains start to form. The birds Strigiformes evolve, owls. The Laurasia theories Carnivora evolve, the ancestor of cats, dogs, bears, weasels, hyenas, seals, and walruses. The primates Tarsiers evolve. The rhinoceros-like placental mammals Uintotherium are the largest land animals at this time. The birds Apotiformes evolve, hummingbirds and swifts. The birds Pisiformes evolve, woodpeckers and toucans. The birds Passeriformes evolve, perching songbirds. This order includes many common birds, for example crows, jays, sparrows, warblers, mockingbirds, wrens, robins, orioles, bluebirds, vireos, larks, swallows, and finches. More than half of all species of birds are passerines. The Afrotheries elephants evolve. The Afrotheries manatee and dugong evolve. 
The Laurasia theory Cetartiodactyla evolve. The ancestor of all Artiodactyla, also called even-toed ungulates, camels, pigs, ruminants, includes deer, giraffe, cattle, sheep, and antelope, hippos, and all cetacea, whales, and dolphins. Hippos are the closest living land relatives of the whales and dolphins. The Laurasia theories Perissodactyla evolve, also called odd-toed ungulates, the ancestor of all horses, tapirs, and rhinos. The Eutheria Lagomorpha evolve, the ancestor of rabbits, hares, and pikas. The Eutheria Rodentia evolve, rodents. The rodents Myomorpha evolve, the ancestor of rats, mice, gerbils, voles, lemmings, and hamsters. The rodents beavers. The rodents dormouse, mountain beaver, squirrel, and marmot evolve. The bird Cetaciformes evolve. Parrots. Horses evolve. The first giraffes evolve. The last common ancestor between hippos with dolphins and whales. The earliest marine mammal and whale, Himaliocetus. The Laurasia theories Chiroptera evolve. The ancestor of fruit bats and echolocating bats. The rodents old world porcupines evolve. The Himalayan mountains start to form. The early whale Ambulocetus evolves. The birds Falconiformes evolve. The ancestor of falcons, hawks, eagles, and old world vultures. The rodents New World porcupines, guinea pigs, agoutis, and capybaras evolve. The primates New World monkeys evolve. The ancestor of the sakis, spider, howler, and squirrel monkeys, capuchins, and tamarins. The ancestor of all extant New World monkeys may have reached the Americas from Africa by crossing the early Atlantic Ocean, perhaps on fallen trees over a chain of islands. Dogs evolve. The birds Cuculiformes evolve. The ancestor of cuckoos and roadrunners. Toothed and baleen whale lines split. Toothed whales include dolphins, sperm, and killer whales. Baleen whales include blue, humpback, and gray whales. The largest land mammal ever known. The hornless rhinoceros Paraceratherium lives at this time. Cats evolve. The primates true lemurs evolve. The first pigs evolve. The primates old world monkeys evolve. The ancestor of the macaques, baboons, mandrels, proboscis, and colobus monkeys. The first deer evolves. The ancestor of all hominoids, gibbons and hominids, loses its tail. The monotreme echidna evolves. The monotreme duck-billed platypus evolves. The hominoid proconsul evolves in East Africa. The hominoid gibbons evolve. The first kangaroos evolve. The first bovids evolve, hollow-horned ruminants, oxen, antelopes, sheep, cattle, and goats. The earliest extant hominids, orangutans, evolve in Southeast Asia. The hominids, gorillas, evolve in Africa. The hominids, chimpanzees, evolve in Africa. This is the last common ancestor of chimpanzees and humans. The first hippos evolve. The hominid, artipithecus, evolves, the earliest bipedal primate. The hominid Australopithecus evolves. Hominids use stones as tools. North and South America connect. The hominid Paranthropus evolves, a line of extinct early bipedal hominids. The oldest formed stone tools. The start of the Paleolithic or Old Stone Age. The hominid Homo habilis evolves, the earliest member of the genus Homo. This is when the human brain begins to get bigger. The hominids Bonobos evolve, the end of the Tertiary and start of the Quaternary period. Homo erectus evolves in Africa. Homo erectus moves into Eurasia from Africa. The controlled use of fire by hominids. The hominoid Gigantopithecus evolves, the largest ape known. Homo erectus evolves far less body hair, except on the head, face, armpit, chest, and groin. Hominids in the genus Homo wear clothing. The earliest evidence of spears. The first humans. Homo sapiens evolve in Africa. The human language of 30 short sounds begins to develop. All words are single syllable. This is the beginning of the transition from the verbal language of chimpanzees and monkeys to the language humans use now, which has shorter sound duration and a larger number of sounds. Homo neanderthalensis evolves in Europe and Western Asia. The start of the worm glaciation, which connects a land bridge between Asia and America. Homo sapiens move out of Africa into Eurasia. This is the beginning of differences in race within the human species. The oldest Homo sapiens skull outside of Africa, in Israel. The earliest human burial, skull cave in Israel. The theory that gods control the universe. Humans use a bow and arrows. Homo erectus goes extinct. The start of the mass extinction of large animals due in part to human impact. Earliest watership, sapiens reach Australia from Southeast Asia. The earliest known mine, lion cave in Swaziland, Africa. The earliest known human-made painting. The earliest sapiens fossils in Europe, Romania. The earliest oil lamp. The earliest musical instrument, a flute, made from the wing bone of a vulture. Humans catch fish. Sapiens reach China. 
Humans weave textiles from flax and use coloring dyes. Humans raise dogs. The earliest ceramic objects, the Venus figurines. The Neanderthals go extinct. The earliest fired clay, clay dried and hardened by fire. Woven baskets. The earliest human-made structure, a stone wall. Cereal gathering. The earliest pottery. The earliest rope. The earliest known map. Lime cement is used as an adhesive on small stone tools. Sapiens reach America, the oldest human bones in America. The end of the Pleistocene and start of the Holocene epoch. This is the end of the last ice age. The start of the Neolithic or New Stone Age in the Fertile Crescent, a region of the Middle East arching from the Nile Valley to the Tigris and Euphrates rivers. Humans shape metal objects from native copper. The oldest city, Jericho. The oldest saddle quern, a flat stone and rounded stone used to grind grain into flour. Goats are kept, fed, milked, and killed for food. The earliest stone buildings and temple in Turkey. Rye is grown in Syria. The earliest settlement in Mesopotamia. Flax is grown. Sheep are raised for wool, skins, meat, and dung, which is used for fuel. Pigs are raised and killed for food. Clay tokens with different shapes that represent products are used in Mesopotamia. Cows are raised for milk, for meat, and eventually for plowing. The earliest flint sickle. A sickle is used for cutting grain. Emmer wheat is grown in Syria. Common millet is grown in China. Barley is grown in Syria. The earliest domesticated plants in America. Squash is grown in Peru. Magar, an Indus Valley city, is founded. Lentils are grown in Israel. Einkorn wheat is grown in Syria. Peas are grown in Turkey. The oldest known boat, a dugout boat. The earliest drum. Rice grown in China. Corn is grown in Mexico. The first metal to be smelted and casted, copper. Smelting is separating a metal from its ore by using heat and the reducing or oxidizing material. The earliest reed boats. The sailboat. The first fruit trees. Olives are grown in Israel and Jordan. The earliest settlement in Europe. Provadia Solnitsada in Bulgaria is founded. Winemaking. The earliest sun-dried mud bricks and mud brick house. The earliest nut crops, almond trees are grown in the eastern part of the Mediterranean basin. The earliest writing on clay objects, the first numbers, the first stamp or seal. The first writing begins as symbols for numbers on clay bulla, hollow clay containers that hold clay tokens. These symbols represent the quantity and kind of tokens inside the bulla. Hollow bully are eventually replaced by solid clay tablets with the same impressions. The sundial, the earliest timekeeping device. The earliest plow. Plows are used to break up soil. The earliest irrigation, supplying water to crops. Donkeys are raised and used for transport. The Egyptian calendar, 12 months of 30 days plus 5 extra days. The earliest known wheel, a pottery wheel. Cotton is grown in Peru. Writing on clay tablets, symbols that represent a product such as cows, sheep, and cereals drawn with a stylus on clay tablets are the earliest record of what will become the modern alphabet. Training of scribes is an early school. These tablets contain a record of objects owned or traded and contain no stories. Ox pulled vehicles with wheels. The earliest record of a belief in gods and goddesses. The earliest stringed musical instrument. The lyre and the harp. Written symbols are combined to form words. There is a transition from word writing to sound writing in Sumerian. The vast majority of Sumerian language is made of one-syllable words. This suggests that all earlier spoken languages contained only single-syllable words. Bronze, copper, and tin are smelted and casted, the start of the Bronze Age. Cuneiform writing, soldering of metals, the earliest dam, the earliest silver objects, metal casting where wax is melted in a clay mold, the first recorded political assembly, the inclined plane or ramp, the abacus, a counting and calculating device. The earliest pyramid in Egypt, designed by the earliest known scientist, Imhotep. Musical reed instruments. The earliest metal saw. The earliest arch. Iron is smelted and casted. The start of the Iron Age in Turkey. Scribes change from writing right to left in columns to writing left to right in rows. The earliest dice and board game. Animal skin is used for writing. The earliest parchment. The earliest recorded written history. Writing on papyrus, the Akkadian language, the earliest known Semitic language, the earliest verb tense and noun gender, the first dictionary, the earliest glass making, glass beads, the earliest written stories. These consist of epics and myths, hymns and laments, proverbs and wisdom. These writings record a belief in gods, goddesses, a heaven and an underworld. 
There are clear similarities between the Sumerian and the later Greek stories. For example, stories about the creation of the universe, good and bad deeds of the gods, and of a flood. Egyptian writing becomes completely phonetic. The first alphabet. The earliest musical horn. The earliest health science text. The first place value number system. A sexagesimal base 60 number system. Fractional values such as 1 over 60 and 1 over 3,600 are also in use. The earliest recorded laws. Humans ride horses. The earliest spoked wheel. Spokes make the wheel lighter in weight. The earliest lock and key. The earliest library catalog. Metal is traded as money. The vegetables leek, garlic, and onion are grown around the fertile crescent. The earliest agricultural science text. The earliest mathematical text. The first planet, Venus, is recognized in Babylon. The earliest oven-baked mud brick, or burned brick. The earliest pulley. The Vedas, four ancient Indian collections of poems or hymns originate as an oral tradition. The water clock, or clepsydra. The earliest American city, an Olmec city in Veracruz, Mexico. The first letters that represent vowel sounds. The earliest Chinese writing. Welding of metals using heat and hammering. Monotheism, the theory that only one god exists. Two-piece mold metal casting. The earliest written musical notation and musical composition. The Phoenician alphabet. The ancestor of the Greek alphabet. Complex pulleys. The earliest lens. The Aramaic alphabet the ancestor of Hebrew, Arabic, and probably the alphabets of India, the earliest Hebrew writing, the Greek alphabet, the Indian alphabets of India and Southeast Asia, eclipses are predicted by Babylonian astronomers, the earliest aqueduct, a channel to move water from one place to another, near Nineveh, the earliest concrete, lime cement mixed with limestone used in an aqueduct, all planets visible to the naked eye, Mercury, Venus, Mars, Jupiter, and Saturn are clearly distinguished from stars in Babylonia. The Etruscan alphabet, the Old Testament, the Torah, the Hebrew Bible, the Ten Commandments, and the story of Genesis. Metal coin money. The universe is explained without using the theory of gods by Thales. The earliest Native American writing. The Earth-centered universe theory and the theory that humans evolved from fish. The Earth-centered theory will dominate until the 1500s. The Latin alphabet. The Earth is described as a sphere. The Sun is explained as a mass of red-hot metal. That the brain controls the body is understood and the first human dissection. The earliest particle or wireless communication. The optical telegraph using fire signals. The theory that all matter is made of atoms. The theory that the universe is made of only four elements. Water, air, fire, and earth. The theory that the Earth moves through space. The Mitana calendar. 12 years of 12 months and 7 years of 13 months. The universe is explained as being filled with many other worlds and the Milky Way as a large group of stars. Grafting of plants in Greece. Plato's Academy. The theory that the Earth rotates around its own axis and that some planets rotate around the Sun. Aristotle's Lyceum. A fifth element, ether, is added. The theory that the moon influences the tides. The earliest chain drive. An automatic repeating crossbow. The museum and library of Alexandria. Euclid's Elements compiles all known mathematics. Compressed air is used for a catapult and for the earliest musical keyboard instrument, an organ, by Tisibius. The cerebrum and cerebellum of the brain are identified. The earliest lever. The earliest screw. The rotation of the Earth around its own axis once a day and around the Sun once a year is understood by Aristarchus. The earliest known escapement, a device that controls the rotation of a toothed gear to provide periodic impulses. The size of Earth is correctly calculated by using the angle of the Sun's shadow and the distance between two cities. The earliest observation of a comet. Metal gears, the earliest evidence of the spur and worm gears. The distance to the Moon is measured using parallax by measuring how much an object appears to move compared to a more distant object when the observer changes positions. The law of inertia, that a body preserves its motion, is understood. The invention of paper in China. A nova is observed. The first star catalog that uses celestial coordinates of latitude and longitude and that divides stars by brightness. The precession of the equinoxes is recognized, that the position of the stars at equinox changes slightly each year. The earliest known metal spur gear and mechanical computer. Negative numbers are used in China. The theory that light is made of atoms that move very fast. The first glass blowing. The Julian calendar. 365 days with an extra day every four years. The earliest water wheel. The earliest elevator or vertical lift. 
the germ theory of disease, that disease can be caused by tiny living organisms, the steam engine, a wind wheel powered machine, the glass prism, the last cuneiform texts, the earliest encyclopedia, the magnetic compass, the earliest known complete musical composition including musical notation, Ptolemy's Almagest, an earth-centered model of the universe with the earth a stationary sphere in the center surrounded by seven larger planetary spheres for the moon, sun, planets, and fixed stars, the earliest press-on printing in China, the Arabic alphabet, Roman Emperor Theodosius I prohibits the visiting of non-Christian temples. The library in Alexandria, the Serapium, is destroyed by Christians. The murder of Hypatia. Byzantine Emperor Justinian closes the schools of Alexandria and Athens, including Plato's Academy. The earliest hospital in France. The earliest windmill in Persia. This windmill uses a vertical shaft and horizontal sails to grind grain. The numerals 0 through 9 and decimal notation. Jabir prepares and identifies acids, woodcut printing, lowercase letters. Charlemagne establishes schools where math and grammar are taught. String instruments are played with a bow. Al-Mamun founds the Beit al-Hikmah, House of Wisdom School, where many scientific works are translated into Arabic. Gunpowder is invented in China, the earliest medical or health science school in Salerno, Italy. Norwegian explorers reach North America, the earliest rocket in China. The encyclopedia, the Suda, paper money is used in China. The pinhole camera, movable type printing, the University of Bologna, the first cannon and gun, the first stringed instrument to use a keyboard, the University of Oxford, the University of Paris, the start of the Inquisition, Pope Lucius III makes burning the official punishment for heresy, the theory that all matter is made of light, the movable metal block printing press, the first eyeglasses, mechanical clocks, sulfuric and other strong acids described, Mondino de Luzzi's anatomy book, the law of inertia is revived, the University of Vienna, the oldest university in the German-speaking world, Sung Kyung Kwan University in Korea is founded, Gutenberg introduces the movable type printing press into Europe, space is described as infinite in size and stars are described as other suns with inhabited planets, the earliest wound spiral spring driven clocks, Gutenberg prints copies of the Bible, the first printed book in Europe, Leonardo da Vinci designs a parachute, da Vinci designs gliders, a helical air screw and a flying machine with flapping wings, humans from Europe reach America by crossing the Atlantic Ocean in three small ships, Europeans reach the Pacific Ocean, the start of the Protestant Reformation, humans circumnavigate the earth, the method of triangulation to measure distance, a baseline of known length is chosen and from its endpoints the angles of sight to a remote object are measured. The distance to the object from either endpoint can then be calculated using simple trigonometry. The University of Santo Domingo, the first university in the western hemisphere. The sun-centered theory is revived by Copernicus. Arteries are tied to stop bleeding. Artificial limbs are created. The scientific classification of minerals. Pulmonary circulation is understood by Servetus. That blood goes from the right side of the heart to the lung where it is mixed with air becoming red and then to the left side of the heart where it is sent through the rest of the body. The first planetary tables based on the sun-centered theory. Servetus is burned alive for heresy. Systematic computations of probability. The first scientific society, a group for the communication of scientific research. The precursor of the Academy of the Lynx. Fallopian tubes and semicircular canals are identified and the vagina, placenta, clitoris and cochlea are named. Cylindrical projection is used to make a map so that lines of latitude and longitude are straight. A comet is proven to be farther away than the moon and to have an orbit that is not circular. The Gregorian calendar, February 29th is omitted in century years which are not divisible by 400. Decimal point notation is used in Europe. Objects of different weight are shown to fall the same distance in the same amount of time. The flush toilet. Letters are used to represent constant and unknown numbers. The first variables. Galileo invents the first thermometer. A variable star is discovered. A star that shows periodic changes in brightness. Bruno is burned alive for heresy. That the Earth is a spherical magnet on which a compass points to the magnetic poles is recognized. And the first electroscope, which measures static electricity. The inverse squared law of light. 
that the intensity of light is inversely related to the square of the distance. The earliest telescope, the law of falling bodies, that the distance covered by a falling body is proportional to the square of the elapsed time is understood. Kepler shows that planets move in elliptical orbits with the sun at one focus of the ellipse and that a line connecting a planet and the sun will sweep over equal areas in equal times. The moons of Jupiter are first seen and their period determined by Galileo. The phases of planet Venus are seen by Galileo. The earliest microscope, a compound light microscope, that the sun has spots and rotates around its own axis is shown. Exponential notation and logarithms. Harvey describes the circulatory system, that blood can only move in one direction, and that blood moves in a circle from the heart to the arteries, from the arteries to the veins, and through the veins back to the heart. The earliest known reflecting telescope, the first double or binary star system is observed. The law of refraction, which describes how a light ray bends when passing between two mediums of different density. The submarine, the sealed thermometer, measures temperature independently of air pressure. That the sun completes one rotation every 25 days is recognized. The transit of mercury across the sun is observed. The speed of sound is measured. Galileo is condemned to life imprisonment by the Inquisition, the Académie Parisienne, the precursor to the French Academy of Sciences. Frequencies of sounds are measured. Harvard College is founded. The Cartesian coordinate system. The transit of Venus is observed. The micrometer, a device for precision measurement. The repeating gun, a gun in which ammunition is fed from a magazine. A mechanical calculating machine that can add and subtract. The earliest vacuum and the barometer, which measures the pressure of the air. The phases of mercury are observed. The concept of momentum, mass times velocity. Atmospheric pressure is shown to change at different elevations. The label of gas is applied to a substance. Carbon dioxide gas is recognized. The first air pump, that sound cannot be produced in the absence of air, is proven. The hydraulic press, the first known moon of Saturn, Titan, is identified. Exponents are extended to include negative numbers and fractions. Red blood cells are observed and described. The Royal Society is formed. Gas is collected. That electrical attraction is transmitted through a vacuum is proven. Acid base indicators. The connection of arteries and veins is observed. That pressure and volume of a gas are inversely related is known. The first static electricity generator. A sulfur globe is rotated against a cloth. The theory that light is made of particles is revived by Descartes. Descartes also identifies both the wave and corpuscular theory of light. The theory that comets move in elliptical orbits. The theory of light diffraction. The period of a Mars day is measured. The first blood transfusion. The wave theory of light is firmly established by Hooke, with the medium being a fluid between the stars associated with the ancient concept of ether. Calculus. Differentiation is used to find the rate of change or slope of an equation, and integration is used to calculate the area or volume described by an equation. Jupiter's period of daily rotation is determined. Double refraction is observed. The element phosphorus is identified. Hydrogen gas is released by mixing iron filings and acids. The corpuscular theory of light is firmly established by Newton. Color is determined to be a property of light, not of objects. White light is separated into and recreated from primary colors. Light of different colors is shown to refract at different angles. The scale of our star system is measured. Protists are observed. The element oxygen is identified. Bacteria are observed. The speed of light is measured from the changing time of the moons of Jupiter entering and exiting the shadow of Jupiter while their distance from Earth changes. Sperm cells are observed. The helical spring. A catalog of southern hemisphere stars. Direct neuron activation, or direct neuron writing. Jan Svammerdam contracts a muscle with electricity. The cell nucleus is described. The first picture of bacteria. The law of gravitation by Newton. That all matter attracts other matter with a force that is the product of their masses and the inverse of their distance squared. A gear cutting machine. The steam engine is reinvented. The concept of energy, vis visa, the living force, which is mass times velocity squared. The size and distance of other stars is measured. The theory that color is determined by the frequency of light. The piano. Newton theorizes that light particles are affected by gravity. The path of a comet is correctly calculated. The theory that the universe is made of mostly empty space by Newton. The movement of the stars over long periods of time is proven. 
A machine uses a perforated roll of paper to form patterns in textiles. The theory that electricity is made of two different fluids. The first clock that can keep accurate time at sea. Life of Earth is systematically categorized by Linnaeus. Storage of electricity, the capacitor, an electrostatic motor. The single fluid theory of electricity. Lightning is recognized as electricity. Citrus fruits are proven to cure scurvy. The basis of refrigeration is understood. Humans recognize that evaporating liquid lowers temperature. A spark is passed through a vacuum tube. The earliest telegraph. Moscow State University is founded. Electrolysis. Molecules are split using electricity. Water is separated into hydrogen and oxygen gases using electricity. Hydrogen gas is isolated. The first self-propelled vehicle, a steam engine powered automobile. Five new gases are identified and isolated, including nitrous oxide and carbon monoxide. The theory that gravity changes the speed of light particles. The mass of a light particle is measured. Oxygen gas is isolated. Nitrogen gas is isolated. The element chlorine is isolated as a gas. Combustion is shown to be a reaction with a gas in the air, later named oxygen. Eleven new acids are identified, including citric and lactic, in addition to the identification of casein, aldehyde, and glycerol. Photosynthesis is understood. Planet Uranus is identified. The motion of the sun relative to the other stars is recognized. The hot air balloon. A steam engine boat. Human flight by balloon. The density of gases is measured. Water is shown to be a compound, not an element. The fusion of molecules using electricity. Water is synthesized by using an electric spark in hydrogen and oxygen gases. The earliest diffraction grating, made with hair. Air is shown to be a mixture of gases and not a single element. Electric and magnetic attraction and repulsion are proven to be both proportional to amount of charge and inversely proportional to distance squared. That volume and temperature of a gas are inversely related is known. Remote neuron activation or remote neuron writing by Luigi Galvani. A muscle is contracted remotely by using a remote electric spark while metal is connected to the nerve. The theory of natural selection, that species less adapted are more likely to die while those better adapted will continue and multiply. Immunity by vaccination is proven. Marble is produced by melting and quickly cooling limestone. The gravitational constant, the mass, and the density of the earth are measured. Elements are shown to combine in definite proportions. The electric battery or voltaic pile. Invisible light is recognized. Infrared light. Hydrogen and oxygen gas are collected separately from the electrolysis of water. Electroplating. The first known asteroid and minor planet, Ceres, is recognized. The invisible light, ultraviolet light, is discovered. The frequencies and wavelengths or particle intervals of light are determined. The first glass diffraction gratings. The three color principle, that only three colors in different proportions are needed to see any other color. The theory of light interference. Spectral lines are identified. The first dry electric battery, that atoms of different elements vary in size and mass is shown. The first table of elements by atomic mass. The steam engine railway train. Asparagine, the first amino acid is isolated. The Fourier transform, that any periodic oscillation can be reduced to a sum of simple trigonometric, sine or cosine, etc., wave motions. The phenomenon of light polarization is observed. Gases are shown to combine in small whole number ratios by volume and not by mass. The first electric light, the arc lamp. Chlorine is shown to be an element and shown to support combustion like oxygen does. Hydrogen is shown to be characteristic of acids. The concept of molecules and the method to determine correct atomic mass and molecular formula. The spectroscope. That substances emit specific spectral lines is known. The spectrum of planet Venus is found to have the same absorption lines as the Sun, and the spectrum of other stars are found to have absorption lines that are different from those of the Sun. The theory that all atomic masses are a multiple of hydrogen. The first photograph. The theory that light is a transverse wave, oscillates at a right angle to the direction of travel in an ether medium. The theory that chemicals contain light. Electricity is understood to cause magnetism. The first electromagnet. The direction of electric current in a wire is related to magnetic force. Magnetism is identified as electricity. The electric current meter. The first gas combustion engine. Uses hydrogen gas combustion to create a vacuum. The dynamic electric motor. The grating equation. The wavelength or particle interval of light is equated 
to the grating groove spacing. The wavelength of light is calculated by using a diffraction grating. The first practical electromagnet. The phenomenon of electrical oscillation is discovered. The basis of alternating current and radio communication. The first permanent photograph and photograph reproduction process. A gas combustion vacuum engine car. Ohm's law. Current is recognized as being equal to voltage divided by resistance. The earliest electronic printer. The first organic molecule, urea, is produced from inorganic sources. Electric current is produced by moving a wire near a magnet. The theory that space is curved. That a curved surface geometry applies to space in the universe. The start of non-Euclidean geometry. A sewing machine. The electrical transformer, a device used to transfer electricity from one circuit to another, in particular a pair of wire coils that can be used to transfer electricity with a change in voltage, current, or phase. The dynamic electric generator, or dynamo. By mechanically moving a conductor near a magnet, a constant electric current is produced. The first plastic materials, made of nitrocellulose. The alternating electric current, or AC generator. A mechanical reaper, a machine that cuts grain. The speed of electricity and wire is measured using a rotating mirror. The electrical relay, a device that allows the electric current of telegraph signals to be carried over long distances. A high voltage induction coil. The electric motor car. The parallax of a different star is measured. 61 Cygni is shown to be around 6 light years away. Cell theory, the principle that all living objects are made of cells. Light is converted into electricity, the photoelectric or photovoltaic effect. This is the first photovoltaic or solar cell. The first use of an anesthetic for surgery, ether. The Doppler effect, that frequency of light and sound is affected by the relative motion of the source and observer. The first remote control explosive. The spiral shape of other galaxies is recognized. Planet Neptune is observed. Nitrocellulose is used to make the first smokeless explosive. The liquid explosive nitroglycerin. The absolute temperature scale is created with minus 273 degrees Celsius as absolute zero where all molecules stop moving. A constant high voltage is applied to gas-filled evacuated tubes. The speed of light is measured using a terrestrial method. Light is shown to move more slowly in water than in air. The speed of electricity in nerves is measured. The rotation of the Earth around its own axis is proven experimentally with a pendulum. Cell division is recognized. The theory of valence, that each type of atom has a fixed capacity for combining with other atoms. A practical passenger elevator. Sound is recorded mechanically by the sound vibrating a stylus that draws onto paper. The theory of evolution is popularized. The theory that life descends from a single common ancestor and that through natural selection only the best adapted survive to pass on their successful traits while the less adapted die out. The spectral lines emitted when a substance is burned are used to determine the atomic composition of the substance. That each element emits and absorbs light at the same specific frequencies is recognized. The first element is identified from the light of the sun, sodium. The finding that a spectral emission line can only be reversed to an absorption line when the absorber is colder than the emitter. The direct acting gas combustion engine. The element cesium is identified. The first element to be discovered spectroscopically. The first microphone, speaker, and telephone. Sound is converted to electricity and back to sound again. Sound can be sent farther as electric current in a wire than mechanically in air and travels silently. The first color image is projected. The machine gun or Gatling gun. The first direct acting internal combustion gas engine car. Spectral lines from elements are matched to spectral lines from other stars. The spectra of nebulae and galaxies are seen. Unlike stars, nebulae are shown to have no spectrum except for a few emission lines and therefore to be composed of gas by using spectral comparison. The theory that light is an electromagnetic transverse wave. The law of genetic inheritance. The 1 to 2 to 1 ratio of inheritance of a trait. Dynamite. The Doppler effect is used to estimate the relative radial or line of sight velocity of celestial objects by comparing the position of spectral lines from the celestial object to those of a terrestrial light source. The first permanent color photograph. A periodic table of elements. The first direct neuron reading. The electricity in nerve cells is measured. The first practical refrigerator. A sound recording is played back out loud. A practical electric light bulb. 
Synthetic fabric, the first synthetic silk, rayon. Sound is sent and received using light particles, or photons. Piezoelectricity is discovered. When pressure is applied to certain crystals, an electric potential is created. And the opposite effect, when an electric potential is applied, these crystals vibrate at a regular rate. An artificial muscle. Slavery is ended. The electronic camera and electronic image. An image is captured and sent electronically. Light is found to have the same speed in any direction horizontal to the Earth. This causes doubt about the existence of an ether medium and about the wave theory for light. The first invisible frequency light particle communication. The first radio communication. The sending and receiving of a message using light particles by electrical induction. Positively charged ion beams are discovered. Canalstrahlen or channel rays. The gasoline internal combustion engine car. The phenomenon of electrical resonance is discovered. This allows specific frequencies of light to be singled out, which improves radio communication. The alternating current electric motor. The electricity of a heartbeat is measured and recorded. Light interference between two radio sources is demonstrated. Electrical induction is confirmed to have the speed of light. Electricity is used to restart a heart beating. An automatic telephone exchange allows people to connect their own phone calls. The theory that matter contracts depending on its velocity relative to the speed of light. The motion picture camera and projector. Moving images are captured, stored on plastic film and projected onto a screen. The double wall vacuum container. The speed of cathode rays is shown to be less than the speed of light. The element argon and the series of inert gases is identified. The element and inert gas helium is identified on Earth. X-rays are discovered. Radioactivity is discovered. Invisible rays are detected from a uranium salt. Electricity is shown to be made of particles, the electron. This is the first particle besides light known to be smaller than an atom. The first electronic display, the oscilloscope. Positive rays are shown to be made of positively charged particles with a mass similar to electrons, later called protons. Hydrogen is liquefied. The radioactive element polonium is identified. Magnetic writing and reading of data. Sound is recorded and played back magnetically. The theory that mass and time change for a body depending on its motion relative to the speed of light. Beta rays of radioactivity are identified as electrons. The temperature of an object is related to the frequencies of light the object emits. Quantum theory. The theory that all energy exists in discrete units. X-rays are shown to kill guinea pigs. Radioactivity is recognized as atomic decay in which one atom decays into another kind. The airplane, the first powered, sustained, and controlled airplane flight. The Saturnian model of the atom, negatively charged electrons rotate around a large mass positively charged particle. Radar, radio light is used to determine the location of distant objects. The special theory of relativity, the theory that the speed of light is constant independently of the motion of all other objects. The theory that motion changes mass and time is adopted, but that an ether medium for light is unnecessary. The electric switch and vacuum tube amplifier. The mass spectrometer, a device that can separate atoms with an electric charge, ions, by their mass. Alpha particles of radioactivity are identified as helium ions. The helicopter, a helicopter achieves free flight while carrying a passenger. The theory of space and time is a four-dimensional structure called space-time. The first images sent and received by radio. The mass and size of an electron is determined. A wireless telephone. The theory that space and time are infinite. The theory of atomic isotopes, that an element can have a different atomic mass but the same position on the periodic table. The diffraction of X-ray light by atomic planes in crystals is discovered. The wavelength or particle interval of X-rays is determined to be smaller than ultraviolet light, which suggests that X-rays are very high frequency light. Diffraction is explained as particle reflection. The dispersion of light by a grating or prism into a spectrum of increasing frequencies is explained as particles of the same spacing as the grating groove at a specific angle of incidence all reflecting in the same direction. The general theory of relativity. Space and time are restricted to a curved surface geometry. The Andromeda galaxy is claimed to have a very high velocity relative to the Earth. The high frequency spectra of elements are mapped and the frequency of secondary X-rays emitted from atoms is shown to relate to atomic mass. Gamma rays from radioactivity are found to have wavelengths in the X-ray region. Sound is recorded and played back with motion pictures on plastic film. The theory that spiral nebulae are other galaxies. The electric propulsion engine. Ultrasonic sound. Sound with a frequency too high to be heard by the human ear is produced by piezoelectricity and used to determine the location of objects by reflection, sonar. The theory that the universe is expanding. The sun is determined to be in the outer part of our galaxy. 
the first electronic read and write memory, atomic transmutation. Atoms of nitrogen are changed into atoms of oxygen by colliding accelerated alpha particles with nitrogen gas. Electronic moving images are transmitted and received by radio. The scanning electronic camera and electronic image display. Spiral nebulae are proven to be other galaxies containing stars and to be very far away. A color image electronic scanning camera. The transistor, or solid state electronic switch and amplifier. The circular particle accelerator, the cyclotron. Women gain the right to vote. The electron microscope. The neutron is identified and distinguished from a hydrogen atom. The positive electron, the positron is identified. Atomic fusion, a helium atom is made from two hydrogen atoms. Atomic fission, uranium atoms are split by neutrons. The first transuranium elements, Elements 93 through 96, Neptunium, Plutonium, Americium, and Curium are identified from the collision of neutrons with uranium. The first image of individual atoms. Atoms are confirmed to be about 0.1 nanometer in size. Element 43, the first completely artificial element. The radioactive metal technetium is created by particle collision. Charged particles with masses in between an electron and proton are recognized. Muons, the first image of a virus, 150 nanometers in size. The bipedal or two-leg walking robot, a planet of a different star is detected. A self-sustained uranium fission reaction. The DNA molecule is recognized as being responsible for the creation and inheritance of structural changes in a body. The first atomic fission bomb is exploded. The microwave oven. Elements 73, tantalum through 83, bismuth are fissioned with deuterons, helium ions, or neutrons. The semiconductor transistor. The fission of medium weight elements. Copper, bromine, silver, and tin. Atomic fusion of large atoms. Carbon-12 ions are fused with both aluminum and gold atoms. The double helix structure of DNA is understood. The first synthesized protein. The maser. Microwave amplification by stimulated emission of radiation. The antiproton is identified. The first human-made satellite, Sputnik 1. The first atomic explosion in empty space. The integrated circuit, or IC. A ship impacts the moon. A device inside the body is controlled remotely. An artificial heart pacemaker is remotely controlled with radio. Photons are proven to have mass. Gravity is shown to change the speed and frequency of light. The laser, light amplification by stimulated emission of radiation. Messenger RNA in the system that regulates protein synthesis in the cell, regulatory genes called operins are identified. The first human to orbit the Earth. The DNA nucleotides code for amino acids and proteins is understood. Laser writing and reading of data. The liquid crystal display, LCD. The first ship to reach Mars and to return images of the surface. The first ship to impact a different planet, Venus. The first ship to orbit a body beyond the Earth, the Moon. Pulsars, stars that emit regularly timed bursts of radio light are identified. Humans land and walk on the surface of the Moon of Earth. A DNA molecule is broken with an enzyme. The Internet, people use computers to communicate over the telephone wire network. The digital electronic camera, two DNA molecules are combined using an enzyme. The first artificial gene is synthesized. The first ship to orbit another planet, Mars. A ship impacts Mars. The first ship to soft land on planet Mars and return data. Proteins are synthesized by using a virus to add DNA into bacteria. A ship reaches Jupiter and sends the first close-up images. The personal computer. A ship orbits, lands on, and transmits images from the surface of Venus. An external object is moved by thought, electricity in the brain. The first images and soil samples from the surface of Mars. The complete DNA sequence of a virus is determined. A self-driving car. A ship reaches Saturn and sends the first close-up images. The scanning tunneling microscope. Individual atoms and molecules of many kinds can be seen. A multicellular organism is cloned. Genetically identical copies are made by replacing the nucleus of one ovum with a different one. Polymerase chain reaction, PCR, a simple technique that allows a specific segment of DNA to be copied billions of times in a few hours. A ship reaches Uranus and sends close-up images of the planet, its moons, and its rings. A microscopic electric motor. A ship reaches Neptune and sends the first close-up images of the planet, its moons, and rings. Individual atoms are moved. A ship reaches and sends close-up images of an asteroid and discovers the first known moon of an asteroid. The first ship to orbit Jupiter. An animal is cloned by replacing the nucleus of an ovum with the nucleus from a somatic cell. A microscopic radio chip, or RFID chip. A remote control device emits drugs inside a human body. A nanometer scale electric motor. 
the first ship to orbit Saturn. Stem cells are used to repair damaged nerves, allowing a paralyzed human to walk. A ship lands on a moon of Saturn, Titan. Remote neuron reading. An image of what the eyes are seeing is captured remotely using magnetic resonance imaging, MRI. Sound a brain hears is recorded directly from the brain. Sound a brain hears is recorded remotely. A microscopic radio, or particle transmitter and receiver. A radio device functions inside a cell. The first human-made cell organelle. Walking robots are produced in mass quantity and are available for the public to buy. This is the start of the robot revolution. How robots replace humans in most manual labor tasks, which greatly increases the quantity of food and humans. The first remote control microscopic flying device. The first wireless microscopic microphone. The micro mic. Remote neuron writing using microscopic devices and neurons. Microscopic devices enter the human body by the lung, enter the blood circulation which connects directly to all cells, and position themselves as organelles inside each neuron. External devices communicate with the intracellular devices to read the voltage and to make the neuron cell fire. Sounds, images, smells, touches, emotions, and muscle contractions can now be remotely activated in a brain by sending light particles to intracellular devices. The first wireless microscopic camera, the microcam. The first remote-controlled microscopic flying camera. The wireless microscopic maser. The wireless nanometer scale radio transmitter and receiver. The nano radio. The first images of thought are seen. Thought images are recorded remotely using remote neuron reading and shown publicly. The first thought image may be the image of a triangle. The first artificial muscle bipedal robots. These robots are lighter and more electrically efficient than motor robots. The first thought audio is recorded. Thought audio is recorded using remote neuron reading and played out loud publicly. The first recorded thought audio may sound like this. One, two, three. Humans start to communicate by thought image and thought sound only. Bipedal robots start replacing humans in most low-skill jobs, for example as walking security cameras and fast food and fruit picking. The first wireless nanometer scale camera, the NanoCam. The first use of remote writing to motor neurons to stop an act of violence. Humans walk around with robot servants. These robots clean and cook for their owners. An artificial muscle robot can fly by flapping wings. The first air highway for autopiloted flying cars is established. The first moon colony. Humans permanently live on the moon of Earth. Bacteria are identified and destroyed by microscopic devices inside an animal body. Cancer cell growth is stopped by microscopic devices. A virus is identified and destroyed by microscopic devices. Humans stop unwanted weather, for example tornadoes and hurricanes, by changing air temperature using millions of distributed remote control nanometer sized devices. Accelerated nano camera ships reach another planet and return close-up images. Most humans communicate only by images and sounds of thought. Helicopter cars form a second line of traffic above the streets. 100 ships with humans orbit Earth. Earth. Most vehicles are machine controlled. Robots walk on the moon of Earth and build buildings. Humans conquer all bacteria and viruses. Nanoscale devices can identify and destroy all known bacteria and viruses anywhere inside or outside of the body. Robots walk and build buildings on Mars, the first ship to land on an asteroid. Large-scale transmutation. Humans can convert most common atoms like silicon, aluminum, iron, and calcium into much more useful atoms like hydrogen, oxygen, and nitrogen. This allows many humans to live independently of Earth, in ships and on planets and moons without water because they can produce all the air, fuel, water, and food they need from the common atoms of planets and moons. The first major nation to be fully democratic. The first humans land on Mars. Nucleic acids are changed by remote control nanoscale devices. Humans live permanently on Mars, the first Mars colony, the first city of another planet. Robots and other machines have replaced humans in most manual labor tasks, driving, cleaning, and food planting, harvesting, preparing, and serving. Robots also do the most dangerous parts of police and firefighting. 1,000 human-filled ships orbit Earth. Nudity in public is decriminalized. Microscopic devices repair, regrow, and reshape damaged cells. Robots land and walk on an asteroid. Humans land and walk on an asteroid. Prostitution is decriminalized in most major nations. This includes all forms of trading money for physical pleasure. Recreational drug possession is decriminalized in most major nations. Robots land and walk on planet Mercury. Robots land and walk on a moon of Jupiter. Most humans are not religious. All money is electronic. Humans live permanently in a ship that orbits the sun. The first ships that regularly transport humans from the Earth to the moon of Earth. 
Humans live in orbit of Venus. The first humans to land on Mercury. Humans live permanently on Mercury. Humans switch to a single time system for all places in the universe. The first microscopic ships to reach another star, Alpha Centauri, and to return the first close-up images of the planets around another star. Living objects on planets of a different star are identified. Bacteria made of DNA on planets around Centauri. Humans land on a moon of Jupiter. Humans send ships with robots to the stars of Alpha Centauri. Most humans in developed nations reject the theory of gods. The removal and conversion of the Venus atmosphere has started. This is the first major removal of a gas atmosphere engineering work of humans. Oxygen and nitrogen gas will be released to create a new atmosphere. The end of death by aging. Using genetic editing, humans grow and develop to age 20 and then hold that body shape indefinitely, dying only from physical destruction. Humans now live for thousands of years. This causes the human population to grow at an extremely fast rate. Microscopic ships reach Barnard Star, the second closest star, six light years away, and send back the first images of the planets around Barnard Star. The end of homicide by remote neuron writing. Humans move an asteroid using the gravitational pull of many ships. An asteroid is moved by propulsion, either by cables or by embedded engines. This is the first asteroid to be held stationary relative to the sun. Microscopic ships reach Sirius, eight light years away, and send back the first images of the planets around Sirius. Humans create atoms from light particles, photon fusion, the reverse of separating atoms into light particles. The first images of large living objects on a planet of another star are seen. Robots land and walk on Venus. Humans land on a moon of Saturn. The first large ship to reach a different star, Alpha Centauri. Smaller robot ships land on all the planets and moons of Centauri. Humans consume an asteroid. Humans live on Venus, the first Venus colony. Humans live on and under the surface of Venus in cooled buildings. Ships containing humans leave for the stars of Alpha Centauri and will arrive successfully perhaps 400 years later. This begins the colonization of other stars. Humans live in orbit of Uranus and land on a moon. Humans change the motion of a moon, a moon of Jupiter. Humans change the motion of a planet, planet Earth. A ship impacts the surface of Jupiter. The first image of the surface of Jupiter is captured. The solid and liquid body of Jupiter is confirmed to be six times the diameter of Earth. A ship from Centauri leaves for Earth carrying matter from Centauri. This is part of a long-term project of bringing back matter from around Centauri to be used around the star Earth orbits where consumable atoms are in great demand. Human anatomical changes start to become apparent as a result of living many generations in low gravity. Humans may start to look like ocean organisms which do not walk but instead move by pushing water using their appendages. Humans orbit Neptune and land on a moon of Neptune, Triton. The start of the removal of the Jupiter atmosphere. Many humans may fear Jupiter exploding. Ships with robots reach the second closest star, Barnard Star. A ship from Centauri reaches Earth and returns the first objects from a different star. Humans around Centauri build ships to explore and pull other stars closer. Humans reach a different star, Alpha Centauri. Humans now live around two star systems and so the chance of extinction is greatly decreased. Humans completely control the motion of planet Mercury. The end of major religions. Most humans belong to no major religion. Ships with robots reach Sirius. The motion of Mars is controlled by orbiting ships. The atmosphere of Venus is completely removed. The motion of Jupiter is controlled. The atmosphere of Jupiter is completely removed. Humans have robot ships at 10 different stars. The rings of Saturn are consumed by humans living there. The first planet to be held in a stationary position relative to the star. The motion of planet Mercury is stopped and the planet is held in a fixed position relative to the sun. Humans land on Jupiter. The Venus atmosphere is like the atmosphere of Earth. Humans live on the surface of Jupiter. The motion of all the planets are under human control. More humans live in ships than live in and on the surface of all the planets, moons, and asteroids. Jupiter is the most populated planet, overtaking the Earth in number of humans living in, on, and in orbit of it. The atmosphere of Jupiter is now nitrogen and oxygen and heated to stay gaseous. Humans have robot ships at 50 different stars. The first image of advanced living objects that evolved around a different star. Humans inhabit 10 stars and have robot ships around 100 stars. The position of the sun is under human control and is moved in the direction of Centauri. The stars of Centauri are moved towards the sun. 
Humans touch advanced living objects that evolved around a different star. Humans form a cluster of four stars, the Sun and the three stars of Centauri, and start to look like an open cluster. Each star is within one light year from each other. One trillion humans. Genetic engineering may produce humans that use photosynthesis, only needing water, oxygen, and light. Genetic engineering may remove the requirement of humans to urinate, defecate, and sleep. One quadrillion humans. 10 to the power 15. Our descendants probably will look very different from humans now, adapted for efficiency and to low gravity space. More humans live around other stars than live around the sun. One quintillion humans. 10 to the power 18. Humans have robot ships around 1,000 stars, inhabit 100 stars, and form an open cluster of 10 stars. Humans have robot ships around 10,000 stars, inhabit 1,000 stars, and form a cluster of 100 stars. All asteroids are consumed. Planet Mercury is completely filled with living objects. Humans reach the center of the Earth. Earth is completely filled with living objects and has a population of 10 quintillion, 10 to the power 19 humans. There is no more molten material inside the Earth. All the molten compressed matter was extracted, cooled, and consumed, mostly as building materials, fuel, and food. Earth is completely filled with tunnels, rooms, and living objects. Humans have robot ships at 100,000 stars, inhabit 10,000 stars, and form a cluster of 1,000 stars. Humans form a globular cluster of 10,000 stars. This cluster starts to leave the plane of the Milky Way galaxy. The human population is now around 50 sextillion, 50 times 10 to the power 21. The population of humans on the planet Mars reaches a physical maximum of 1 quintillion, 1 to the power 18 humans. The moon of Earth population reaches the maximum possible, 100 quadrillion, 100 times 10 to the power 15. All the planets of the sun are consumed. The matter inside the planets was used to make more ships, fuel, and food. All that remains are ships that orbit the sun. Most matter must now be taken from the sun and other stars. The sun is consumed. All the planets of Sirius are consumed. Sirius is consumed. 10 to the power 100 humans. All the stars in the Milky Way galaxy belong to a globular cluster. The Milky Way is now an elliptical galaxy. The star clusters in the outer areas are pulled closer to the center, making the galaxy more spherical. And the galaxy develops a massive propulsion system in order to go get more matter to consume. The Milky Way is now a spherical globular galaxy. The Milky Way globular galaxy integrates the matter of the two Magellanic Cloud galaxies. The Milky Way and Andromeda globular galaxies join. The Andromeda and Milky Way globular galaxies may merge into a single larger galaxy which then resumes the search for a smaller galaxy to consume. Natural selection must also create a large-scale eat-or-be-eaten, predator-prey existence for galaxies similar to that on Earth. 